Hey, what's up guys? This is the Game Hunter. I know what episodes locked her slug it out too. And in this episode, that fella over there, the one that is right there, is gonna be the spotlight slug. I'm talking about Negashade. Negashade is one of the latest additions to the game, so let's find out what it does. Negashade casts shadows on the opponent's tiles and deals damage over time. This is exactly like the special ability of Negashade in Slug Terra Slag It Out 1. So let's find out what is a good team for Negashade. Before doing that, we always have to go to the store because I'm always looking for food. Uh, not for me, for my slugs. Okay, so let's find out if there is something available actually for Negashade. This is perfect. We can probably get some more food. A little bit, a little bit, a little bit. Probably it's too much. Yeah, we won't be able to get to level 14, but it's always, always worth it to stop by by the shop or the store every time you can. Oh, perfect. So close to get enough food for Marco Breaker level 15. But again, this is one of the first suggestions that you have to do every day in Slug Terra. Slug it out. Go to the store and find out which slug is available and get as much food as possible. Don't spend all your gold, but try to pick the ones that you probably your favorites. For example, in this episode, I was trying to get Negashade to level 14. Um, you know what? We should probably do that. All right, let's do that. Let's do that. Let's do that right now. Perfect. I'm going to spend some gems so we can get Negashade to our next level. That will be level 14. Almost there. Almost there. Almost there. Perfect. Okay, so let's get out of here. What is Negashade? Negashade from... Wow, it's going to increase the health in 101.4 hit points. And the damage increase plus 30 po 34.1. That is great. Yes. Okay, so if we're using Negashade... -doo -doo, first, you're coming with me. That's the... My all-star team. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, go and check my previous episode when I was beating the last boss in Slug Terra, Slug It Out 2. All right, Vine Drill is definitely the next one. So no questions asked because it's probably one of my favorite, I think it's one of my favorite slugs in Slug Terra, Slug It Out 2. So let's put Negashade in here. Okay, what else, what else, what else? Cast shadows on the opponent's tiles and deal damage over time. I remember in Slug Terra Slug It Out, Slug It Out 1, one of the things that bothers me the most is when I was using, my opponent was using Greenock and Negashade together. It was so, so, so annoying because Negashade was converting some of the tiles into shadows or getting like, a, like some kind of cloud on top of the tiles. And in the meantime, I got a Greenock. Greenock put in mines or bombs all over the, the board. So it, things got super, super, super crazy. And usually my opponent used to hate that. So we're going to go with Negashade, Greenock, uh, Tenasher. Let's continue with Tenasher. Tenasher is so, so, so good. And maybe we can try. Maybe we can try. Oh, Lava Links. Also, we need to do another episode. Lava Links is so many slugs that we still need to double check. Probably Thuglet. Either Thuglet or um, maybe Ramstone. Let's bring Ramstone. Yeah, that's a good idea. We can put Ramstone in front. After that, we can put Negashade. And after that, Greenock for maximum damage. Okay, so let's go into the campaign. One of the most difficult missions. Let's go into single mode, single player mode. How many of you guys already finished the game? Let me know in the commentary section. I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys already finished Slug Terra Slug It Out 2. The last boss was kind of tricky, so if you're still struggling, go to my previous video. You're going to see some tips about how to defeat the last boss in Slug Terra Slug It Out 2. All right, so let's go into something maybe... Maybe around here. All right, let's go over here just to see what Negashade... That's, and let's see if actually the combination with Greenock and Ramson is gonna work. So, slug it out, Bunk Morgan. No idea, no idea what is that guy. Let's see if we can get a, okay, there's a ton of tennis share in here. Perfect. We got Ramson for Ramson right there. We can put it, look at this, look at this, look at this. Five Ramson in one second. We can probably put five Greenocks right here. Perfect. So we are in good shape. We can say, oh, 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 you're not touching me, my friend. You're not touching me. You can say Greenock now. And finally, Negashi. Ah, oh, Negashi is not going to be able to do much. This is only level one. Okay, we're going to need to wait for... Oh, 
Tenacher, perfect. So we can start charging our slugs. Tenacher is my favorite charger in the game right now. I just say that, yes, and it's true. Okay, now we can send Greenock and now Negashade. Four behind, let's see. This, well, uh, remember, this is something that we won't be able to see because it's my opponent, the one that has all the clouds on the screen. But uh, I'm pretty sure it's getting really, really annoyed. So, <laughs> so let's continue with that. Can we put Ramstone here? Maybe green up one more time with another level five. We're so close to level five. Just, just wait. Let's just wait. Oh, perfect. Got another green up right there. Let's send Ramstone, green up, and Nega Shade. That should work really, really well. Perfect. Got another one. Tenashe in the middle. Uh, green up over there. One more time. Tenashe, go, 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 go. Go, go. <laughs> That's perfect. Because we're gonna start charging the rest of our slugs so, so, so fast. Uh, okay, let's send Green Oak and then Negashade right away. Why not? Why are you wasting time now? Perfect. Ooh, yeah, I almost missed that one. I missed that one. I missed that one. We got Tenisher almost ready. Level three. We can put Ramstone right here in the middle. Excellent. Ramstone, you go now. See, the more you practice, the better you're gonna get in games like this. That's absolutely the only tip that I can give you, fellas. It's really not that complicated, but. You have to practice. That's like you, everything in life. Everything in life is like that, right? Okay, let's see. We can put Green Oak right there in the middle. Okay, so we get Ramstone, Green Oak, and Negashade. That's it. Game over, baby. <laughs> that was so much power. That was so much power. Unfortunately, unfortunately, when you play in this uh, mode, you really won't be able to appreciate the power of Negashade. But when I was fighting against Negashade, it was such a mess. It was such a mess. Everything was turning ghostly and or, or with shadows. It was so difficult to clear. Let's go to another battle. And uh, one more time with the same combo because I believe Ramstone, Negashade, and Greenock together, it's awesome. It's just so, so good. This is not the same, right? Oh, this is the shadow. Oh, the board just changed and I was trying to get everything going the same way that in the previous battle. Of course, that's not gonna work. And let's see, we can get a green oak over there. Perfect. This is not gonna be easy. Ah, I don't like this board at all. How can we get something? Okay, we just shut down a Flatulor Hinkus, which is good. Okay, we got over there, one in the middle. We got another one. Perfect. Finally, level two. Finally get one slug, level two. That was gonna help us a big time because right now, everything is so difficult. It's so difficult. Okay, perfect. Platero Hinkus, you come in, that's fine. We're gonna sh come to you with Nega Shade. One more time, we won't be able to see all the shadows and the ghostly tiles, but you know what? I know it's happening. And I know my opponent's not liking that. Okay, perfect. We got Tenasher almost level two. Level two already, perfect. So we can send Tenasher now. Excellent, okay. That's the way you use Tenasher, guys. That is exactly the way you use Tenasher. Wait for low level slugs and then send it. Ramstone absolutely amazing and this is gonna hurt this is gonna hurt so badly because that's the perfect combo for using ramstone green oak and also negashade excellent negashade is almost getting ready we got with ramstone right there in the middle and if we can get a tennis one more time level two that would be awesome perfect because that's gonna definitely allow me to start charging the rest of my slugs so 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 good uh so if you ask me which one should be the this locks that you should unlock or probably find food and spend food on it. Um, I will say that we're gonna counter that. Yes, definitely. If you can get Tenasher, that would be amazing. Tenasher is so, so, so important. It's such an amazing charger. Even when Fandango used to be my favorite, but you know what? Things change and this is a new game. And, <laughs> and for some reason, I find the Negashe is a lot more useful. A lot more useful. Especially in single play campaign because. Uh, the, the opponent, especially well, in single in single player mode, in the story mode, they always attack you with the same strategy, like a low level slug. So, it's, oh, I think it's a better idea to just uh, have somebody. Ooh, I should better. Stay, better stay quiet. <laughs> better stay quiet because I just said that my opponent is gonna send me low level slugs, and all of a sudden I get an attack by a frost crow level three, and after that I receive the attack of Latulor Hinkus. That is not good at all. Okay. Tenacher, perfect, perfect, Tenacher is gonna save me one more time, guys, one more time. Let's say we can get Ramstone level three, that would be super cool. Ramstone is level three, excellent. So we're gonna shut down Boondock, that it was coming this way. 
Excellent. This is not good. I, I need to counter both. I need to counter both. I definitely need to counter both because we cannot deal. Okay. With the uh, Flatter Hinkus now. No Flatter Hinkus. Flatter Hinkus is not allowed. You have to shut down Flatter Hinkus no matter what. No matter what. There is another tip that I, I need to share with you guys. Okay. We almost. Uh, we're in better shape now. We should be okay too. We got Green on level 3. That's great. We can probably put Tenasha right there in the middle. Uh, we also got a. Uh, we got some Ramson. Ramson should be okay. Perfect. Ramson is going. Green Oak is going right after. Tenash is almost ready to go level 2. Almost level 2. I cannot believe that it's taking so long to finish this battle. The battles are so tough now. Okay, we can probably put Ramstone right here. That's it. No, 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 no. Tenash is gonna eat every single one of those slugs. Excellent. Now I have the full combo. Go Ramstone, Green Hog, and Negashade. And that's definitely gonna hurt. Sorry, my friend. That's gonna hurt big time, but we still, we haven't win this battle, guys. We haven't been this battle at all. We need to find another way to get Tenasher going, or we won't be able to win this one. Perfect, ooh. Ooh, at the last second I was able to send, uh, I thought that was Green Up, no? I think I, I think I was Green Up. Don't ask me, guys. Right now I'm just trying to get matching tiles as fast as possible, which is becoming a nightmare. But you know what? I think we should be in good shape now. Let's see if we can get a... Oh, you're coming level 2. I need to shut you down. I didn't want to do that. I'm going to need to shut you down again. Wow. This is getting super tough. As long as we send... Oh, that's going to hurt. That is definitely going to hurt. Okay. Guys, we need to hurry up. We need to hurry up. We need to hurry up. We are losing right now. No, we're still winning. But we're still, this is getting so close. I don't like close battles. Is that you know that anything can happen after that? Mega shade. And I noticed something when I was doing the live stream the other day, guys. That is so difficult to play this game for more than a, I don't know an hour in a row. It was so tough. I just couldn't. I couldn't keep up. It was so difficult. But I. Believe it or not, we still were able to finish the story mode. Okay, Ramstone, Negashade, that, who, wow, we're going with everything. That's gonna do it. Shadow Clan, good night. Ooh, you're still alive. Ooh, let's better hurry up. <laughs> better hurry up because this is not looking good. We're not gonna allow our opponent to come back now that the battle is completely under control. We're trying to get Ramstone level three, that was probably be the safest way to finish this battle. Uh, the problem is I don't have enough tiles to match Ramstone perfect. I got Ramstone right there. Perfect level. Uh, won't be able to. Well, we're gonna be able to go through and then Negashen and Green Up, and that will do it. Victory! It's ours! Negashen is super entertaining, guys. Again, the only problem is that we are not able to see exactly what's going on in the opponent boards. I wish there was an option to do that. That would be super cool seeing the opponent. That was something that I love about the single player campaign in, um, no, the multiplayer in Slugter is like it out one because you have the opportunity to play to get against other players, right? If you have an iOS device because an Android wasn't available, unfortunately. But uh, I, I hope that in the future they decide to add something similar for Slug Terror Slug It Out 2. That would be super cool. I'm pretty sure you guys are going to love Nega Shade once that we have multiplayer. So you guys are going to be able to see exactly what is going on in the opponent boards. But I strongly recommend you to give it a try. In combination with Greenock and Ramstone works like a charm. Fellas, this is the Game Hunter with another episode of Slug Terror Slug It Out 2. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share my videos, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care, everybody. Oh.